Yeah. Right, so I'm going to start by giving all praise here about Shame Out Shy. Devil is a post GMS, and all you see about doing the work and truth and what's sincerity. Well, a quick one, this is Jeremiah 10 and 1. It says, Hear ye the word of the Lord, which uh, the Lord speaketh unto you, O house of Israel. Thus saith the Lord, Learn not the way of the heathen, and be not dismayed at the sons of heaven, for the, uh, for, the, for the heathen are dismayed at them. For the customs of the people are vain, for one cuts the tree out of the forest, the work of the hands of the workman with the axe. Right, and that's once again, that's a period of time that we're coming into, man. You know, because here it is, you know, people think that uh, Christmas isn't about, it isn't about. The Lord, you know, scripture say not to celebrate that shit, man. You know, because that shit comes all the way back from uh, Nimrod, Semiramis and Tammuz. You know, which is the trinity which the Catholic Church likes to speak about. So what you have to realise is a lot of these... Uh, quote unquote Christian holidays and Christian doctrines have basically been butchered and mixed in with other pagan things. Right? It says they deck it with silver and with gold. They fasten it with nails and with hammers that move not. And that's the thing. That's the, that's the Christmas tree again, man. You know, they put all of those fancy ornaments on it. You know, make it look all shiny and pretty. But at the end of the day, it's just a tree. It says they're upright as the palm tree but speak not, they must needs be born, it's just all Quaker English for they need to be carried, because they cannot go. Be not afraid of them, for they cannot do evil, neither also is it in them to do good. Right? And when you understand the story of Nimrod, Semiramis, and Tammuz, right, basically they used to put that, uh, give those uh, put presents underneath the tree, uh, basically because they believed that if they didn't, ill would come of that. The scriptures are telling you, no, ill is going to come of that, because at the end of the day, it's just an idol. You know, you you know, and when you read through, you know, I'm just gonna stick to the point. You know, but at the end, like it says in verse two, man, that's a, that's, a, that's the way of the heathen, man. You know, and Israel ain't supposed to be dabbling in those, you know, in, in that witchcraft and that madness. Man. So you know, I'm just gonna say shalom.